Race number 65, which is the male school eight open division one B final. The male school eight open division B B1 final, but for the 150th rowing of the Heads of the River, it's Scotch College winning the Open Division 2 A final, so well done to them. Here, Nick Amy has really put it on for the 150th year of the Heads of the River. And as the crews now come up for race 65, the B final of the Mail School 8 Open Division 1, we have very close contention here. Xavier College ahead of Brighton Grammar 5, our ball followed closely by Wesley College out in lane two, within a foul ball as well, Haylesbury College in fourth place, and then closely followed by a canvas back to Carey Grammy in lane three. As they now, we see the crew going for another push, but we still see Xavier College out in front, throwing their length. So this is the first cruise of all the boys' schools that were not able to get in the A final, but it's great racing here and fantastic to see this Xavier College crew out in front. Xavier really uh, support rowing greatly. Uh, they've got a great facility on the other side of the river there and their uh, president of the parents, David McCready, is certainly getting a lot of atmosphere going amongst the Xavier College Rowing Club. And here they are now in the B final. Uh, very tight racing though because Brighton Grammar alongside them also having a great season as well. Nothing much between these two crews as they come up now with 750 metres to go. And it's um, Xavier College and Brighton Grammar. It may be Brighton Grammar could have moved out to about a half a length lead at this stage from Xavier College with uh, then Halebury and Kerry Grammar vying it out for fourth place. Sorry. Halebury and Wesley College vying for fourth place with Kerry Grammar back in fifth position as we move up now towards the last 500 metre mark and it's Brighton Grammar. Brighton Grammar now out in front, rating 36 strokes, looking to lift their rating. So Brighton Grammar out in front by about three quarters of a length from Xavier College in lane number five. Then we go over to Wesley College in lane number two. They are about three quarters of a length behind the Xavier crew. And then we're down to Halebury in fourth position and Wesley College. So here we are in the male school eights, open division one B final, and it's still Brighton Grammar. Brighton Grammar, Xavier trying to peg them back, have lifted their racing again. And this is a great race for this, the B final with Brighton Grammar still out in front, maintaining a three-quarter of, of a length lead from Xavier College over then to Wesley College in lane number two, followed then by Halebury in lane number six and Kerry Grammar. But as they move up now with just coming up to 100 metres to go, it's this Brighton Grammar crew of Lockie Ewers, Thomas Haddon, Robert Cap, Oliver Barden, William Lewis, Nicholas Phillips, Jason Mann and James Stewart with Simon Farrow's Cox and they have moved out now to a length and a half. Brighton Grammar, a length and a half winners in the B final from Xavier College. Xavier College with a further length back to Wesley College. Another half a length back to Halebury and two lengths back to Kerry Grammar. So well done to Brighton Grammar. Winners of the Open Division One. B final, Brighton Grammar with Xavier, a very gutsy row into second place there. Luke Parika, Hamish Delaney Small, Jack Guy, Ewan Jenkins, Callum Kelly, James Ward, Richard Green, Harry Armid is the stroke, and Ben King just not able to uh, get across over the top of Brighton Grammar. Then over to Wesley College, and then Halebury and Carey.